Hello, my name is Anders Hansen and I'm a psychiatrist and an author. On average, we spend three to four hours per day in front of our smartphones. And if we're teenagers, it's closer to five hours. These hours are spent on something that did not exist 12 years ago. Never in human history have we changed our behavior so fast as we have done during these last 12 years. So how are we affected by that? That is the topic of my book, Instabrain. In this book, I start by looking at what in our screens makes them so addictive. What mechanisms in our brains are making us vulnerable? In 10 chapters, I look at how screens affect our attention, our ability to learn and remember, our interest in other people, our sleep, and how our well-being is affected by social media. This book is not about my opinions. It's about what science is saying. Did you know, for instance, that you will learn more if you read a text in a physical book and not on a screen? Especially if it's a difficult text, then you remember more details and learn the content more profoundly if you read a physical book. And the advantage of books over screens are, are increasing for every year. So we don't become immune to digital distractions. We become more distracted for every year that passes. Or did you know that if you have sleeping problems and leave the phone outside the bedroom, you will sleep better, even longer? This is especially relevant for teenagers where sleeping problems have exploded during the last decade. Of course, our screens are not only causing problems. They are also invaluable tools. So this book is not about alarming about technology, it's about learning how to use technology in a smarter way so that you are in control of it, rather than being controlled by it. Knowledge is power. This book is directed to everyone who wants to learn more about how they are affected by our new digital lifestyle. In Sweden, this book contributed to a discussion about the consequences of tech on our well-being. I hope that you will find the book interesting.